Hello everyone, today we're going to do a short feature tour of ForSync for Windows. After installation and registration, you'll notice a ForSync folder appear in your system. You can add or remove files and interact with it like any other Windows folder. Simply select your files and drag them into the ForSync folder. You can then go on and do other things while ForSync runs in the background. To check the status, move your cursor over to the taskbar where you'll notice a small blue icon that indicates ForSync is syncing your files. When it's finished, check your ForSync folder where you'll find a green check mark next to each file, confirming that syncing is complete. If you see a blue icon, that means your files are still being uploaded. Another cool feature is the ability to instantly share your files. Right click on a file to see a list of options and ways to share your documents and photos. You can send a file to a friend via tweet or direct URL link. ForSync also generates a handy HTML code that you can paste onto forums and message boards for wider distribution. One other thing I found useful is the ability to check your sync history. ForSync keeps a record of when you transferred files as well as dates and times. Personally, I like to keep my tracks clean, especially when dealing with sensitive or confidential files. You can also choose to wipe your tracks entirely by clearing the history at the click of a button. If you want to get into the nitty gritty, you can also view options in the preferences panel to modify and upload and download speed caps, check how much storage is left, or unlink your machine from your account. For other download previews, check out download.com for more videos, reviews, and screencasts. Thanks for watching.